Live like downtown tonight where you know it's feeling a lot busier and even mm -hmm. feeling a little bigger this weekend. The party has begun. Thousands of people are in town for Saturday's Big Ten Championship game between Ohio State and Wisconsin. And Rich Van Wyk has a look at what the Buckeye and Badger fans can expect before kickoff at Lucas Oil Stadium. Hey, John, welcome to FanFest, Big Ten FanFest. You can take a look at what's going on here. People, kids of all ages are having a good time. This is just one of several venues, several events. People can go to enjoy themselves while police are working to keep everyone safe. All of downtown is a stage for one of the nation's biggest college football games. Tina, Jamie, and Nina are among the biggest fans of the Big Ten Championship. Huge deal. Huge we come deal. Every year. every year. Every year. Whether we're in it or not, we come every we're year. This year's matchup, Ohio State versus Wisconsin, is expected to pack Lucas Oil Stadium with 70,000 Buckeye and Badgers fans. For the first time, Mike Maxwell ditched his buddies and brought his daughters instead. So it'll be a different experience, but it'll still be a lot of fun, I think. Hotels and restaurants, they'll be packed. Tailgate parties will fill Georgia Street and other locations. It will be no party, though, for police responsible for protecting visitors. We want them to enjoy the festivities, and while they're going on, we want them to feel safe. So a lot of time and effort goes into it, and we are just thankful we're working with a good team here in Indianapolis. For the Big Ten game, Lucas Oil Stadium will have the same security procedures used during Colts games. Across downtown, IMPD has added security cameras. Big vehicles may be used to block streets and protect the crowds as they did during the Circle of Light celebration. Officers will be on the streets and above them. The SWAT team and bomb squad will be downtown as well to prevent trouble or, if needed, respond quickly. Security intended to protect people and not scare them. We had this discussion I this just, morning. It's becoming a part of our lives. Yeah. yeah. It's, and we it's so much a part of our it. lives anymore. It's become, we've become numb to it. Yeah. And it's, it's sad, but... That's the way it's the way it is today. And tonight, Saturday and Sunday. That's right. Security is going to be in, in place until early Sunday morning to make sure everyone stays safe. Coming up at six o'clock, we'll take another look at Fan Fest, see what else is going on, and see what people think about it. Back to you guys. All right, thank you, Rich. So many opportunities. Nice arm. 